Okay, well, time for a crazy project. Uh, I'm not even sure I should be doing this video, but I mean, we really need content, so. Uh, okay, so I was actually wrong. Uh, this is not paying out 1 million percent. This is paying out 10 million. This has got to be a typo. Okay, it's not a typo. Okay, so this is actually paying out 10 million percent APY. So the first thing I want to say is I am definitely not going to invest in this project. I'm not even sure you're going to be able to pump and dump it because, um, yeah, is this thing actually out yet? I don't think this is out yet because I'm pretty sure Murdoch DeFi's YouTube said it's not yet launched. So, yeah. All right. So I'm going to just keep this video short because I actually want to go back to reading and analyzing the contract code. I might need to take a little break from it because my mind's already a little whatever. Um, but, uh, I mean, this is just a Titano fork. Uh, obviously, this is not going to be sustainable, like, at all. Also, this is wrong. He didn't actually change this on the website because... Uh, at 10 million percent, a thousand dollars now is probably worth a lot more than that, I think. So this is the first DAO worldwide using an auto state and compounding protocol. Uh, I don't know about that. And you get a reward every three seconds. Oh, jeez. So I don't understand how when you have projects like this, like they're constantly sending requests to Binance Smart Chain. I don't know how uh, the fees are still remain very cheap. It's kind of interesting. Uh, this is definitely not these, <laughs> right? They only have a telegram, of course, you know, you're buying sell taxes, but they have a 3.25 trillion maximum supply. Okay. So this is actually a Seifu fork. Okay. So that makes this a lot better because for some reason I thought maximum was going to be like, uh, this percentage APY forever. So that actually makes it much better, but. The problem is because the APY is so large, I mean, the amount of dumping pressure is just going to be too high. So I don't know if this thing could actually go up. Yeah, the initial, yeah, this, yeah, I'm still going to avoid this. You could try the pump and dump. I'm, I'm probably not going to. Uh, so the only thing I'm curious to know is... Uh, okay. Uh, the one thing I, do they have a, they have a white paper? Oh yeah, it's up here. So the only thing I'm interested in is the long-term interest cycle. Hopefully they'll actually mention this. Uh, there's their auto burn, insurance fund, blah, blah, blah. Of course, how is API calculated? Yeah. All right, here we go. Uh, Okay, so, so, the, so their epoch is every three seconds, they call it whatever. So this thing is, God, these things are really small. Five zeros and then this giant number, five zeros and then a much smaller number. Okay, so there is point, so zero, zero, two, one, two, three, four, five, zero, zero, two. Okay. I'm going to actually link to this in the YouTube description. So if you want to figure it out, but basically, uh, it's not cut in half. It's cut down by like 99. I don't feel like doing the math to be honest. So 10, a hundred. It's definitely more than 95% cut re reduction, which it obviously has to. Um, hmm. uh, it's cut, by, but basically it's two. Uh, fuck, I don't even know how to do this. I'm still like distracted by the code and all that math from minor analysis. I'll try to get the fraction for you though. Oh, Jesus. All right, you know what? Why am I torturing myself? Well, oh, that's right. I did recently clear my history for security reasons. Oh, my brave. That's why nothing's showing up in autocomplete. All right, you know what? We're going to do this. So this giant idiot number divided by an even bigger number, which is this. I believe this is how it's done. 
Oh god, I hope this thing doesn't crash. All right, so this is a uh, 98.2% APR reduction. Okay, well, okay, that was a lot easier. All right, so maybe this won't be so bad. I mean, it still will, but I mean, again, I thought this was going to be a permanent thing. <laughs> But, I mean, at least it's a Seifu fork, right? So, yeah. Um, I don't know. It's still going to be producing way too many coins every three seconds. So, you're just going to have way too much dumping pressure. Um, I don't know if you guys want to gamble, but I'm kind of tempted to gamble a little bit. Like, I would gamble like 50 or 100 bucks. Like, something very small, all right? But... Uh, I don't know. I don't. I don't think. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to overcome the constant dumping pressure. So, I don't know. So you can check out Maximum. I mean, I'm not even connecting my wallet to this site. I mean, it's just basically an error copy and paste. But I mean, I guess if you're gonna do a high APY project, it really should be. Uh, it really should be something like a Seifu thing, right? Because right now, Titano forks are out of season like titano dying sphere is getting killed like everything's just getting killed right now all right and there's still like is crypto is it bitcoin even at forty thousand? i mean it's kind of like doing okay a avax of course is down like this yeah oh binance is up that's good yeah so i mean we just have to wait i think the markets are up today though stock markets that is yeah crude oil is up stock, yeah but I mean, the problem is like stocks have literally been like dumping like crazy like since last Friday, last Thursday. So I mean, it needs to bounce a little. So I don't know. We'll see what happens. I know that the bond markets were selling off like crazy. Oh wow, that's actually a lot. Yeah. So cash is moving in the stock markets right now. Everyone's still avoiding cryptocurrencies. So all right, we'll see how it goes. And again, the problem is if bond yields go up, I mean that puts extra pressure on crypto anyway so it's like you just can't win man you just can't win uh, but you know we, that's how it goes i mean again i'm still waiting for the federal reserve next week i'll go live of course you know low roller coaster roller coaster i mean i haven't seen him post a youtube guy in a while i i didn't have time to respond to you uh on the comment section because honestly i'm busy I would like some rest as well. Also, I just now noticed my skin's dry because it's cold and dry out there. So I put Vaseline to moisturize my skin, forehead, kind of thing. But yeah, I mean, I'll be going live next week, so. Mm. But yeah, anyway, I want to keep this video short. So check out Maximum. It's not yet launched. I'm not going to bother to find out when it will because, you know, I'm not going to, I'm not going to try this project. But, um, but yeah, I don't know if you're really a crazy degenerate, I mean, 10 million percent APY is pretty tempting for the first uh, 12 months. Yeah. For the first 12 months. So, and of course it does correctly cut the APR down to something actually manageable, uh, you know, by 98.2%. So I actually didn't do the math on this. What is the yearly APY when this thing does actually drop? Um, let me think. How do I? All right. So first, I gotta get this number, copy, and then I mult ninety eight point two. So I gotta multiply this by one zero eight two to get the real APY. Uh, then the yearly APY afterwards will be one hundred eighty two thousand three hundred forty eight percent forty nine. Oh, so this is actually going to be 182,000 APY a year until the maximum supply is reached. So you're still going to get a really good APY after this thing tanks. So if I were actually interested in this project in one year somehow, and this site is still going, I would wait till like it's ultra, uh, it becomes really cheap, and then I would actually just buy it at the bottom. Um, but I don't even know if I'm going to remember it by then. So uh, yeah, jeez. Ah, Safe and sustainable. Oh God, people are so blatant. Anyway, I'll see you in the next video. It'll actually be Rubik Finance because everyone's nagging me about it. I'm really kind of hoping it's just a simple project that I'll understand. Because if it's like a Dex, or whatever, I'm not even gonna research it. I'm just like, yeah, it looks legit. Whatever, you can check it out. I'm not gonna do anything because 
too complicated, blah, blah, blah. All right, but... No, let me find out what Rubik Finance is. I mean, I assume it's R-U-B-I-K, right? Or however it's spelled. So, okay, unlisted. So let me set my thing to public here. Okay. Uh, you know what? That's a nice looking thumbnail. I'm just gonna leave. Oh, great. It's not. Uh, I better unlist that because I thought the I thought the thing said the checks were done. Hold on. All right. I love it when the yeah. Oh, okay. It's still checking. Oh, that's weird. Well, it is a 23 minute 39 second video. So, all right. I'll see you next video. It'll be Rubik Finance since everyone's been nagging me about it. All right, I've been ignoring it. Right. Uh, but. Again, that's why I need people that keep suggesting projects. Like, one person isn't really going to do it. But if, like, 50 of you actually nag me about it, it's like, okay, well, I better check the project out then, right? Because, you know, because that's how I gauge interest, right? If if only, like, two people or one person is interested, then, yeah, I don't care. 50 people? Okay, well, yeah, okay, you know, so. All right, like, subscribe, share this video around. Let's help grow this channel. Got a bunch of assholes trying to take the channel down. Right, because they didn't like that I was honest about their shit project they're trying to scam people with. So uh, yeah, and again, thank you to all the new people and uh, older people, uh, uh, returning viewers. You know, supporting the pro, uh, <laughs> supporting the project, my channel that is, which is technically a project too. Right. All right, I'll see you next video. Thanks for watching.